This is a church. Hi. Wow. God damn, you know, finding abandoned properties is ex an exciting process. I, you know, you go onto Google Maps and all that, go into Street View and everything, and you're you're looking at it and you think, yeah, this looks like a really fun place, but nothing can prepare you to actually see it appear from around a bend, seeing what it actually looks like. It's both exciting and also unbelievably terrifying. The worst part about this is, uh, in between me and the abandoned property, which is just up this hill, why is all abandoned properties I've gone to up a hill? Between me and that is sheep. And if you know one thing about me, I absolutely hate sheep. And now, this isn't a big abandoned property. I actually, I know nothing about it, but all I know is it's there. And we're gonna go and explore it. So, let's go. There it is. There's the abandoned. The abandoned something. I don't know what it is. I'm thinking a. Ch well, no, because it doesn't have the bell. I was thinking a church, maybe at some stage. Whoa! What the fuck? Go away. Go away, because you will attract the mothers. I know. Don't fucking fall either. Damn. Well, they can jump. Uh, hi. <laughs> you do. <laughs> okay, well. Don't mind me, I'm just passing through. Okay, okay, I just noticed, look at this. This was like part of a mill. Let me go up to the other side so you can see. So the water would run through here and this thing would turn. <gasps> Which it still kind of does. Oh, I wonder how old this is. Can't be that old. Wait, no, how old would this have been? Look at that. Oh, it's quite dark, hold on. There we go. Look at that, how cool is that? That's really cool. That's the remnants of the wheel that turned. Oh, it's just a shame it's not whole. Actually, it must be quite old if it's, if there's sections basically rusted away, but that's not the focus. And I forgot to take my gloves and it's absolutely freezing. Oh, I don't know what's on that. What's, what's on that, what's in that? Nothing, by the looks of it. The roof has just collapsed. Barbed wire, oh, double barbed wire. Okay, well, there's no other way to tackle this than to than to just climb, I suppose. I'm gonna have to set the camera down. <sighs> Holy shit. Oh. Now, the thing I worry about, I'm so exposed, like all these houses can see me. And I don't know how private, like how owned this is. I don't even know if I'm gonna get in here, but I'm sure gonna try. There goes the first pigeon that just flew out. So that's good, that's a good sight. Well, fuck you. Little asshole, look at you gliding along there like you own the place. I probably shouldn't be swearing because this is exactly what I thought it was. This is a church. Uh. Any pigeons? If there are, fly away now. Oh, here's a bed. This is an old metal bed frame. And that is the door to the church. So. Uh. Uh, oh my god. I'm gonna have to set the camera down. Now the inside handle is covered in poop, so... Come on. Wow. Whoa. You have no idea how... Hello?
Hello? Hello? Hello? Hello? Hello? Okay, well, let's take the camera and look inside. I bet there's tons of pigeons up there. Wow. So, like I said, this is an abandoned church. And it's actually, my uncle is renovating a church. He's actually making it into a house. And it, it's quite a bit bigger than this, but it follows pretty much the exact same scheme. I think I see the remains of a, a bird down there. Somebody's going fast. Now, the one thing I don't want is rats to be living in this hay. I really don't want to be stepping over it in case a rat decides to jump up and bite me. If that happens one more time, I, I will freak out. Yeah, rats is the, the thing I'm worried about. They do nest in hay. Oh, and there we go. There's a pigeon. Looks like he's been there for a while. Let's look at the pulpit. Whoa. Let me switch off the light. How dark is it in here? That's actually pretty light. Anyway. Wow, that's the bone of an animal. What kind of animal, I'm not sure, but it's definitely the bone of an animal. Now, this pulpit is really nice. I do. Ooh, this floor is... Hi! Wow! I am... Wow! Okay. Oh, well. One visitor so far. How do you get in this pulpit? Well, oh, it all looks wrecked down there. Not much to see. Is that the other end? Is that the other end of the pulpit? Oh no. Oh no, that's the other end of the pulpit. That's the door end. I wonder how old this is then. You just imagine all the, all the churchgoers sitting in their pool pews. I mean, then who would who would sit here? Is this just other pews? Is this just where you can sit? Because it's very um, it's very intimate with the uh, the pastor or the priest, the minister. I think it's time for the thumbnail photo. It's another it's another short one. I don't like these short ones. Jeez. Somebody driving some kind of sport mobile. Sport mobile? What age am I? <laughs> I don't know why all this hay is here. I hope the microphone is still on. Oh, the microphone battery is very low, so. But there you have it. There's the, the abandoned church. The fir our first abandoned church. Yeah, my, my uh, like I was saying, let me, um, my uncle is renovating a church, but it was really cool because underneath the floor, they found like uh, a tin that had fruit in it from, was it the 1800s, I think? The late 1800s from Australia. Anyway, I think that's all we can really see in here, unless there's any old tins of Australian fruit. Oh, I just wonder what's up there though. Probably pigeons. Normally with these abandoned places, I, I'm not really sad about it. That was a pigeon or a rat. That sounds very rat-like. Hello? Who is up there, Monsieur Pigeon? That sounded more like a rat than a pigeon. Anyway, let us close the door. Oh, there's nothing to latch it. Let's leave it the way we found it. Ugh. Don't want to touch that door handle. Well, there we go. So that was that. And I'll see you at the car. Oh, and uh, 
By the way, Magnus, you little bastard. I'm only joking. Magnus was supposed to come with me today, but it's actually good that he didn't. Well, we would have gone to the house where I got attacked by a pigeon. If I was to just come here, it would have been a pretty boring one that lasted two seconds. There's another one for the books, my guy. And there's a Tesco delivery van behind me, so. I think we'll just wait for him to do his thing and then I'll go. By the way, sorry about not having a video out on Saturday like I usually do. Or do I usually on Friday? Friday night. I do apologize for not having one available on Friday night. And the reason being is uh, because, well, we're getting work done on the house and I, I have to watch the dogs and um, let me think, what other excuses can I make? Oh yeah, um, I'm very busy, but no, I've just, I've not had time to make to make uh, videos so that's why this one is is late this one's just gonna be late it's not gonna be i'm not gonna save this one for friday because consistency is key so i want to keep going fridays obviously saying that i just missed last friday but still tune in next week because it's gonna be a good one